The DSNAP application period is over. Now the wait begins for those expecting to see their benefits loaded into their EBT cards. DSNAP, the application process ended on Saturday and we are working diligently, all hands on deck still to get uh, the people who applied who were approved their benefits. So we're still working on that. And Public Health we'll spokesperson the, Don we'll Sulat says it's all hands on deck for the department, working full steam ahead to process thousands of applications. Preliminary reports showing a total of 35,206 applicants applied for the disaster benefit. 34,073 applicants, or about 96% of total applicants, were approved. But this figure is subject to change as officials review each application. In mind, this number is subject to change as we are keying them into the our system. So what that means is maybe there's some flags, there's some discrepancies that we're looking at right now. So that number may go up or down depending. Sulat also asking for patience as it may take longer than anticipated for applicants to see their benefits due to the high volume of applications. We are working on that and we thank everybody again for their patience and we know uh, they are, they waited in line, we're just asking for them to be patient some more. Uh, we are, again, like I mentioned earlier, we are all hands on deck. We're working on getting all those benefits out uh, in a timely process. And yeah, right now people are keying in. I, uh, we're working on getting them to see that. Those who applied on or before June 24th who have no discrepancies in their applications may receive their benefits on Monday after 7 p.m. Public health officials are currently processing individuals who applied on June 25th and June 26th. Please, again, check into the, uh, the numbers on the pamphlet that they are provided, and we'll keep you and the rest of our media partners informed as we move forward to see if there's any other hiccups on the road or, you know, that you guys know all of these are loaded, so that way if it's an isolated incident, like someone from the first day didn't get their benefits, there may be a discrepancy that we will check up on. And again, we are calling those that may have a discrepancy as uh, stated in an earlier press release. DSNAP participants are also reminded that their benefits will be valid for 274 days. Matsuki Hariyama, KUAM News.